What's up guys? Welcome to today's first impressions video. This is about Rocket League. Now, if you're wondering what that is, I have three words for you. Holy shit. Rocket League is insane. Uh, if you're kind of wondering what the game is, it's pretty much a blend of NASCAR, soccer, and Mario Kart that a bunch of people just jammed up into one game. And it, it's just fun. I would say it's almost <laughs> the definition of fun. I've, I've only been playing it by myself so far, and it has been completely enjoyable. I think I have like six hours in now, and I haven't felt a dull moment in any of that. Um, it's actually on sale right now, so if by the end of the video you really want to get it, I would go for it, because it's like 11 bucks. It's It's been a ton of fun, and I can already give this a pretty good seal of approval. But if you're wondering why the game makes that for me, um, go ahead and stick around and we'll get right into that. Alright, so what makes Rocket League so enjoyable is really a combination of things and I think that's what we're gonna dig into first. The first thing I'll start out with is gameplay. Gameplay is fun, fast, I can't think of another F word. Fuck! Wait, there we go. Okay, so yeah, it's, it's a challenge but it's also quick and you have to really be thinking the entire time about what you're gonna do because if you don't, you're gonna score on your own goal and you're gonna feel like a fucking idiot. I have at least twice a day the entire time I've been playing it. Uh, yeah, gameplay, it's... Uh, whether you're playing on controller or keyboard and mouse, it's gonna be a little difficult to get all the turning right, but it, it does make the game really interesting and offers a lot of variety in what you can do. Another big feature of Rocket League that I really like is its massive variety. Uh, even in just customization, you can change the car type, tires, paint, type of paint you use. You can put a decal on it, you can put an antenna, you can fucking put a foam hat on top of your car if you want. There's just so many options there for personalization that it's pretty insane. And some of the items even have rarities, so that gives you a bit of incentive to keep grinding out the game, um, if you so wish. And then there are also map varieties. Uh, there's an entire playlist just for trying out new maps. And then there, on top of that, you know, you have the regular soccer matches, and you have hoops, and you have hockey. And it just offers a lot of content, and that's something that I really enjoy about Rocket League. Also, the sounds and music in the game make a pretty immersive experience. It's really professional quality music. It, I don't know how they did it and pulled it off with a $20 game, but it sounds amazing. And you can also hear like the sounds of the crowd. So it just puts you really in that feeling that holy shit, I'm really in this arena and I'm about to go fuck up that other team. The graphics in the game are also well made. Uh, the textures are incredible. It, it looks really, really good all the time. Uh, I actually haven't had a moment where I thought the game looked kind of shitty. It's, it really, for a $20 game, it, <laughs> Rocket League blows my mind with the quality of production that they have put out. If there are any negatives to really be pointed out about Rocket League, they're just nitpicks. Like, I dug as deep as I could into the game, and the only things I've really experienced might not even affect everyone. Uh, what, I, what I have to say is uh, the multiplayer can be a little unfair at times, and unless you're willing to go and play ranked, which you have to play 10 matches to get a rank, so you can play with people around your skill level, it, it might fall a little short and be kind of a pain in the ass because really really good players are in the casual games that are just like the 1v1s and so forth and they really dominate the game you'll either win 8 to 1 with a guy carrying you or you'll lose 0 to 6 while the other team has two people that are scoring all the time and it's really I never really found games that were in the middle of that um, anything that I ever did seemed like luck and Everything else was just me getting my ass kicked. So, as far as the multiplayer goes, if you have ladder anxiety and you just want to play casual, you might be in for a very bad time of just getting your ass kicked. Uh, I had my girlfriend play for a little bit, and she wanted to... <laughs> I think halfway through a game, they were losing like 4-0 to zero or something like that. And she was just like, yeah, I don't want to play anymore because I'm losing. Yeah, had to deal with that. Anyway, um, that, that can be a slight issue. Um, the only other thing that I could really find was that it could get repetitive. 
Um, I only have six hours in the game right now. You know, it's still first impressions. But if you got a thousand hours in this game, and you had every collectible, I unless you really want to take a competitive look at it and really dig in with that, I I just don't see where that much time would come from. Because unless you're you know playing with friends and it's exciting, it, it would just get a little bit repetitive for my taste, I think. And that's really the only two bad things that I can say about this game. Overall, I would say that Rocket League is almost a must-have for any Steam library. It, even though it does have a couple quirks, it's so overwhelmingly over-the-top amazing that you just have to try it at least once. And right now it's on sale for, I think, $11, $12. If you've been thinking about it, you should definitely buy it now. Now is a great time to get it. Uh, it, it just, it's so good. I don't know. I, I didn't think it would be that good. And I'm honestly, I used to be an Xbox fanboy. So seeing like a PS exclusive, I was like, nah, it's stupid. I ain't going to play that. But it is really something worth playing and it is enjoyable. So if you like the video, leave me a like or a comment. You know, I love hearing opposite opinions. If you don't like the game, I want to know why. Maybe I missed something. It's first impressions, you know? Anyway, don't forget to subscribe too, because you know I'm desperate. <laughs> See you guys later.